what's up guys welcome to the channel it's another day and we have another bmw problem here uh, the engine light came on i'll be putting the screen recording on here as well so you guys can see what exactly the code is for As you guys can see uh, from the screen recording, I'm getting two codes for fuel tank ventilation system malfunction and tank ventilation system 2 inlet point malfunction. The codes are 190F08 and 191C02. The third code is there because the coolant cap usually goes, they usually wear out. Uh, that's probably why that code is showing up. And the third or the fourth code is there because the OBD2 is always connected to the car, even when the car is off. In order to get rid of those two first codes, I've got this fuel tank breather valve from Amazon. I'll post a link in the description. It's a pretty common problem with the BMWs and the process should take you about five minutes, maximum 10 minutes. Uh, I'll show you the process to you guys over here. So you just wanna take the front cover off for the engine. It's just a few clips. So you got three clips right here, one's right here, one's right here, and one's back over there. The way these clips work is that they, you can, if you pinch on the groove side, when you pinch them, the opposite direction gets expanded and it takes the clip out. Uh, it's easier if you just grab a plier and you just pinch on it or just squeeze it a bit and just slide it out like that. There you go. That's the first one. The second one is the same thing. On the groove side, just put the plier there and pull it out like that. Or you take this off, it's not gonna slide out to the front. So you have to take, you have to slide it out of the, the spot. It's, the BMW has made for it. So just pick it up a bit. So now you have a, a lot more space to play around with. I'm just having a bit of a trouble taking this off. So I'm just going to get this wire out of my way. So this gray piece right in the back over here. So it's supposed to be sitting like this. You just wanna push it back like that there you go this clip is off now I can try to tackle the, the piece in the back this clip is very stiff there's one on the bottom side as well like this um, what you want to do is you just want to push this back and the piece in the bottom you want to push that back as well it just it should just come out um, so I do have a vehicle room over here but I don't exactly have any access in the back mm, so Ideally, we do want to push this backwards. You want to do the same thing with the one on the bottom as well. You won't be able to see that in the camera, but that's what I'm trying to do right now. Okay. The silencer is a little loose. There you go. Okay, and the piece is out. So this is the piece we're replacing, and we're replacing this with the new one I picked up on Amazon Prime All right, and everything goes back in pretty much the same way here the silencer is still pretty loose so you just wanna push this back inside there you go you heard the click it's in the place right now and this piece right here I would suggest putting it on right now because you're not gonna have a lot of wiggle room afterwards Go. Just making sure it's secure. And the clip we took off earlier, we can put that on right now as well. right here this is the easiest one just push that in okay this in and the last clip right here uh, also one more thing i already 
taking this out from here on the bracket just so it's a lot easier for me to pull it back and forth same thing for this one as well since this one is already in i can put this back inside okay and just push it and there you go put that back inside and your new piece is installed all right guys uh, i can still see the engine light over here but i will be doing the reset on the msd flasher and i'll drive around the car for a few days and i'll see if the car if the light comes back on if the light comes back on then the problem is not solved and this video is not uploaded if this video is uploaded it means that the light is gone and one last thing guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe we have some big things coming for the channel